thick manual. It's got a whole bunch of pages in it. Um, so it's not just like a one-page information sheet that leaves you kind of confused as to what's going on. You have a full detailed description of every parameter in the drive and what it does. They also include a CD which has the manual and some additional information on it as well as I believe some programming software. When you go and you're going to program your drive, for example here I have a CFW10, there's two different layers of programming in here. There's a parameter layer and there's a value layer. And so the way this works is you scroll through um, the parameters and each of these parameters corresponds with a function inside of the drive. So for example you might have motor speed or ramp time or something like that. Each one of those will have a parameter with a number and you can look these up in the manual to figure out which ones you need. Now the value layer is underneath that. When you press program you switch to the value layer. This is the value you're setting that parameter to. And so for example with motor speed if I were to go into that parameter and hit program, it'll show me the default speed and I will be able to then set what my motor speed is. So if I have a uh, 1600, 1700 RPM motor, I can then set 1700 RPM, press program again to save it, and you're done. That's, that's it. There's no code, no macros, no, no strange things that you have to do. It's all very simply just pick a parameter, set a value, save the parameter. That's all there is to it. Now there's a couple of built-in safety features on these drives which are really nice. First of all, you can't get in to change the values without first setting a password that allows you to access the, the internal functions. Now the reasoning behind this is so that you don't just bump a button and accidentally change a parameter or have somebody else come up and mess with the drive. Um, this parameter, this program parameter is found in the manual and once you set that password then you have full access to all, all of the parameters in the drive. The other nice thing that's built in is that all of the factory default settings are saved into a uh, non-volatile read-only memory which means that they are not accessible to be changed by the consumer. So if for some reason you ever program yourself into a corner and you're not sure exactly what's going on, it just won't work and you want to just start all over, you can simply go on this drive, it's parameter 204, set that 